Hello guys, Igor here doing one more app summer review. Today review, reviewing video link, um, a new app summer deal related to live streaming that could be a restream alternative or a B live alternative and even a one stream alternative of them previous app Zumo deals. So the idea here is to do more streamings, more views and more weight with one platform. So you're going to use a pre-recorded video, adding, for instance, an, uh, a new URL, or um, you're going to use uh, your RMTP connection. You can, you can use Zoom or any other player uh, live streaming player compatible with VideoLink and VideoLink will share your video to different destinations, for instance, YouTube Live, Facebook Live, Twitter, and even your blog, um, your website, and your online school. Yes, you can use VideoLink to connect with an online school to share your live streaming, your live online class. So here's the dashboard we can see here on the AppSumo website and let's see how the deal works. So that one is a three codes deal. If you want the most features, you need to buy three codes. I would recommend you to buy three codes because they already said that they will only add the chat feature for those who buy at least uh, who buy the three codes. And what is the chat feature? The chat feature is um, a chat inside the dashboard where you can see your comments and you can interact with your audience since you are going to be streaming your live to different kinds of destinations, Twitter, um, Facebook, so on. So, as you can see here, if you buy one deal, you get 10 live channels and as a bonus, 100 total GB visual link CDN as a one-time usage. If you buy two codes, you get more live channels and you get um, the API access. If you buy three codes, you get the API access and DVR and CNAME upon request. So the difference here are the number of live channels and of the features as the NDVR and CNAME. So what's an NDVR? The NDVR? You use the NDVR to let your live audience to see previews, uh, to see delayed broadcasts. So let, let's see, let's say, uh, so you started to broadcast at 5 p.m. and someone just arrived at 5.30 p.m. They can, using the NGVR, start to see your live streaming from the beginning instead of seeing it uh, live where you, where, you are, where you will be streaming right now. So the NGVR is the feature that does that. And they have a CNAME. So if you like CNAMES, you can use it with three codes. So I'm going to explain now the bonus feature. So by now, by now, they didn't change already. But by now, as I said, you can use video link to stream to your blog, website, or online school. But this streaming is not lifetime deal. The lifetime deal is related to the destinations or the social media where you will share your video. So you have unlimited out output hours related to that. But if you want to stream to your blog using their player, everything that use their player you don't have a lifetime deal. You have a one-time usage that is 100 total GB with one code and 500 total GB with three codes. This seems a good deal. Uh, this is a kind of a rare kind of tool to appear as a lifetime deal. So I think it's going to work. 
work. And if you can, if you work with live streaming, try to get three codes to get all the features. So let's see now how the tool works. We are here on the live stream dashboard and I'm going to click on login. So I'll click here on client portal. Oh gosh, no, you click here on control. Okay, I'm going there. So here I'm on my control panel. Okay, so it's easy to understand how it works. It can be a little bit of handy to understand how to connect your tools, but then you're gonna test with time. So you can see we have home, source, destinations, and channels. The first thing you're gonna do are gonna connect your source. As a source or where where your video comes from, you can use an RTMP a capable encoding device or software. For instance, Zoom works here. So my use case is using Zoom to broadcast live streaming to my social media live. So you can use Zoom and with Zoom you can do screen sharing. Okay. Um, you can use your web uh, or your webinar to live stream to different channels at the same time. You can use your webcam and then you stream directly using your webcam on your computer or mobile. Or you can use the Unwarrel as the video input source. Okay, you can use Unwarrel to connect your video. You can see here that I already, already connected a webcam. On destinations is where you're going to choose to where <laughs> your video will broadcast. Okay, so you can see the current destinations. The most famous ones are Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Tweet, Twitter, uh, um, RTMP. Uh, they have the output as well, and others as Vimeo and LinkedIn is coming soon. So most of people are gonna use Twitter, YouTube, and Facebook, and maybe Tweet. And you can, of course, connect different Facebook destinations. Okay. You can see here that I tested and I connected my Facebook timeline. So under your, your, your Facebook account, you can connect your timeline, page, etc. And here you have your channels is where you connect your source to your destination. It's really easy to understand and it appears on your home as well. So let's connect a channel here. So I have, I'm going to create my channel name so like my fb timeline and, and you select all your destinations so when you will have that channel you will broadcast automatically so you don't need to select two five six seven destinations okay i'm going to connect here the one that i write connect that is my fb timeline and then next you're going to uh, choose a source since I only have webcam by now, but you can connect Zoom and any, any tool that connects by using RMTP. So here is webcam and I'm going to create my channel and you can see it's done. So when I connect one of my webcams um, uh, and I click, when I click here enable, it's gonna start the video, okay? And here is going to my FB timeliner. And here I can add a schedule. Okay, so when it's go live. Clicking here, go live, I'm gonna go live. Okay. You can use a uh, closed captions. Um I sincerely don't know exactly how it works by now, but it seems to need to have to use their partnerships and then so with video link you can stream videos with subtitles at real time okay and you have the encoder that's related with their players so let's see here you can see my source number of okay on my um and i'm offline okay so 
And here you can see the player. The player is the unique feature that VideoLink has that differs it from one stream and restream. So with VideoLink, you can live stream to your blog, to your online school. So it's a live stream to websites. So you use the player and then you can select, you can advertise using the player, using VAST or Google HTML. You can select if it's going to be a pre-roll, mid-roll, post-roll. You can select the kind of video controls, if they're going to start video, if you're going to start muting the audio, selecting video quality, full screen or not, and even adding a URL to post your image. And you can design your uh, the player with the colors of your brand. And they have different presets. So you can see clicking here. I'm changing the configurations and it changed the video screen. It's skin. Okay. Here you select if it's live stream or video on demand. And you can add your player name and description. They have a middle um, analytics tool, okay? Um, and you can schedule your stream as well. So creating a review re here about everything that we just see, you can, video link is a tool between stream, stream yards and restream and one stream. So the difference here from one stream by now is that VideoLink has live streaming um, and one stream doesn't. You need to upload a pre-recorded video. Also, VideoLink has a player and one stream and restream doesn't have a player. Also, you should remember that the lifetime restream deal has branding so restream automatically stream their link to your social media destinations facebook twitter etc so it harm your deliver deliverability the deliverability of your life okay so if if i think you want to buy it if you work with live stream i think you definitely need to buy that too it seems neat it seems cool. It seems that they will evolve. And with pandemic, this kind of tool will be really used for the next years. If you need more live channels, you buy more codes. If you want the CNAME and the NGVR feature, you buy more codes. Okay? Remember, you can pre use pre-recorded video here or live stream and also you don't get by now a lifetime deal as for your blog and website or online schools because their players have a one-time usage cdn so you need to pay more and calculate your costs okay thank you so much for that review if you like it please click on the button below it's free and you help me so much bye bye